Gabriela de Souza. So today I'm going to be explaining the Excel function sum product. I will start off by explaining what the formula does and then demonstrate with an example. So this is the sum product function and it's an extremely versatile function that multiplies ranges or arrays together and then outputs values that are the sums of the products. So it's important to note, looking at this formula, that the function treats non-numeric items in ranges as zeros, and all the array arguments must be the same size. So if I'm multiplying array 1 with array 2 and summing them, they both have to be of the same size. And so I'm going to use this hotel acquisition template from Top Shelf Models to demonstrate an example of how we have actually used it. So we're going to go to the Comp Hotel tab and look at cell D69. This is the formula that we're looking at. So basically what this formula is saying is that Excel should add the ranges from C58 through C60 through C68. So that's from here to here. And then multiply that result with the result from the sums of the ranges from D58 through D68. It should then divide that result by cell C69. And these dollar signs are just locked in so that it does not reference any other cells when moving forward. And so in this example, we have used this function in the hotel acquisition model to calculate the weighted average for the year opened of the primary competitive by taking the number of keys and the year the hotel was opened in. So this is the information that we're computing it from. And so this is just one example of how we have used the sum product function, a very simple example, but we can combine it with other Excel functions to make it more complicated and to compute more uh, complicated information and data. And so this is an extremely versatile function. We usually use it when we have large amounts of data to compute and not a lot of time to add multiple formulas. To, we use it to check errors, calculate weighted averages or information that um, is more harder to, com to compute with a single formula. And so uh, it can be combined with any other formula to save time, and we use it a lot in real estate private equity. Thank you.